Okay. I'm back. It's take March five. 5th. Yeah, take five. It's March 5th. We were last at this yard. I was last at this yard on President's Day, which was January 21st. So it was about 13 days ago. We put in pollen sub and syrup. So we're going to get into that. But I'm here. Any professionalism is gone. It's gone. Eric and I are together. Sorry. So here with Eric. Hey, everybody. Eric has worked with the Be Informed Project partnership. and partnership. 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 Says that wrong every time. And a little bit of the uh, Maryland Extension as well. Yeah, right? we're here yeah, University of Maryland with that with Mark there, yeah. So when we were getting set up, uh, I had to ask him something that he was getting ready to tell me and thought that it would be good here for other people. So Eric, the beekeeper with lots of hives, is also allergic to bees. Yeah. So yeah. I said, hey, if you get stung and try to die, what do I do? And his answer yeah. is, because he yeah. hasn't given it to me yet. Yeah, I told him anytime I you know, get in the bee yards with people, I always make sure to tell them you know, where my two EpiPens are. I always have two on me when I get in the yard. One for me and uh, one for me and uh, extra for me. Yeah. And sometimes <laughs> for someone else. That's happened once and it was, it was everybody lived and it was a good deal. Um, <clears throat> but anyways, you'll precaution careful and you know, I'm not giving any advice here but I always have two on me one's in my pocket and one is in my breast pocket and these are actually great ones um, I like these these are the AviQ happy pen because they talk to you so when you pull it out it tells you what to do so if I pass out it'll tell you and, and you can follow the directions Eight. so yeah. it's Jason proof good yeah it's good. Jason proof That's so good. yep so if you do get stung and you start having like seizures and foaming at the mouth, I will turn the video on and film it first. <laughs> Be sure to catch that live. <laughs> All right, so so he has it. Where do I stick you with it? Um, in the leg, please. In the yeah, leg. leg. But typically you want to make sure there's nothing in the way. So, okay. you know. Through not, the suit or do I need to yeah, get the suit's fresh fine. with you? Yeah. And... No, you can, well, if you want to. Okay. And I'm passed out. Um, <laughs> That's horrible. Cut that out. Professionalism gone. Yeah, no, I'm yeah, not cutting it out. This is bad. <laughs> Anyways, I also think that it's important to say that I'm here as a, uh, you know, not affiliated with either organization. So what I'm saying is not necessarily the perspective of either organization. I work with the Informed Partnership or uh, University of Maryland, so or B Lab. So anything that we say dumb is a reflection on the yeah, two of us individually. Me personally, else. as a, as a <laughs> moron. <laughs> All right. Well, we're gonna actually finish getting ready, but wanted to put that on. So we'll be back.